That's not what we wanted. We got a bunch of water pouring out. At Dominion's money pit, after replacing his old reliable wash plant, Parker's first fire up on the new shaker has just ended in disaster. If we let that keep running like that, it's going to wash the bank out here and take the wash plant with it. The idea of this new wash plant was to speed us up down here, but we're still messing around with things. If we would have just brought Big Red over here, we could have had it running one shift. It's really a pretty janky setup at the moment, and it's not working, which is very frustrating because it's holding up sluicing, and it really can't be. Uh, there must be a fitting loose. Was it this one or that one? A faulty hose clamp has burst a water line. Oh, yeah. No, this is just a little too short. OK. And there's like a maybe half inch gap. I don't think we're going to get it closed up. Parker discovers the spray bar hose is too short, causing it to leak. Oh, we could turn that spray bar off, though. Like that entire bar off? Yeah. But let's just turn the spray bar off and try this again. We got a fitting that's leaking on the plant, and what we're going to do is just shut that spray bar off. We want to see if there's anything else we got to work on. Bypass is closed. That fixed most of it. Lori, we'd like some dirt, please. Hit the conveyors. Spin them up. Finally, after two long years, Parker's custom wash plant is sluicing pay dirt, giving him a chance to catch even more gold in the final weeks of the season. Thanks for getting this done. It's a nice setup. I like the plant. And there's always going to be a few quirks to work out, but I like it so far. Well, she's going to take some fine tuning, but it's washing rocks. <laughs>